In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to open a RAR file in Google Drive. So RAR files are quite similar to zip files where you have one file that stores a whole lot of different other files inside them. And if you want to know how to open zip files in Google Drive, Timmy made a video about that a little while ago, and you can go back and watch that. The process will still work. But if you want to open a RAR file in Google Drive, there's actually a very similar process that you can do that. So in this video, Timmy's going to show you how to open a RAR file in Google Drive. So when you're on your computer in Google Drive, you just need to find your RAR file. So you can see here, Timmy's found Timmy's RAR file, and it's a .rar, so it is a RAR file. And then if you just double click on it to open it up like this, you won't actually be able to see what's in the RAR file, so that can be a little bit annoying. But if you go up here and click on Open With, you'll see these th three different websites that you can connect to Google Drive that are meant to open the RAR file. And some of these might work, but Timmy's found all of them to be a little bit difficult, if, even if they even let you open the RAR file at all. But there's actually one called Zip Extractor that's not showing up in this list that Timmy finds really good and it works really easily. So if you click on Connect More Apps down here, you can then search for Zip Extractor specifically and add Zip Extractor to Google Drive, and that will open the RAR file much easier. So if you search in here and you just search for zip extractor and it's come up here, you will see here zip extractor. So just click on this little Google Drive icon with the plus to add zip extractor to Google Drive. Click on install and click on continue. And then a window will pop up like this asking you to give zip extractor access to your Google Drive account. And that's really the only way you can proceed with unzipping your RAR file in Google Drive. So you'll just need to choose your account that the zip file is in. Timmy's only got one here. So just click on that account. And then it will tell you zip extractor wants to add itself to Google Drive and view and manage the Google Drive files and folders. And you can just click on allow. And now it will allow Zip Extractor to have access to Google Drive. And now you can see we're back in Google Drive and it says open with Zip Extractor here. So now you can just click on open with Zip Extractor. And now it's going to open up Zip Extractor's website and put the RAR file into Zip Extractor so that you can open the RAR file in here. So as you can see here, here are the, all the files that were inside Timmy's RAR file. And they're all checked here, so if you want to only extract a few of the files from the RAR file, you can uncheck some of them like that, so that now you're only extracting these two files, but you probably want to extract all the files. So Timmy's going to tick all of them, just leave them all checked. And then once you're happy with the ones you checked, just click on Extract here. And it will start extracting the files from the RAR file, and it will put them into your Google Drive. So in a minute, once this is done, it may take a few seconds or a few minutes if it's a lot of large files. But then once it's done, all the files that were in the RAR file will now be in a folder in your Google Drive. So we'll just wait for this to finish. And that's finished. It only took a few seconds. So now if you click on View Files here, it will open up your Google Drive in a new tab. And as you can see, here are all the files that were in your RAR file. So if you go back into Google Drive, which is where Timmy's RAR file was, or if you go back into wherever your RAR file was, you'll see your RAR file is still here, Timmy's RAR file.rar. And there will now be a folder that's Timmy's RAR file.rar unzipped files. So you can go in here, and that's where your files are. So now that that's done, you can rename the folder if you want by right clicking on it and then clicking on rename and you could change the name of that or you could delete this RAR file here because you don't really need it here anymore by clicking on it and then clicking on the trash icon and now the RAR file is gone. So that's really cool and that's really all there is to opening RAR files in Google Drive. It's a nice easy process and it's a lot easier than having to download the RAR file to your computer and then open the RAR file on your computer using some other kind of software and then uploading all the files back to Google Drive. This just does it all in Google Drive with no downloading and uploading. It just does it really quickly and easily. So that's really cool and hopefully you found this video helpful and if you did, please click on the thumbs up button down below and if you want to see more videos like this, click on the subscribe button down below and click on the little bell icon next to the subscribe button to be notified every time Timmy makes a new video. So that's really cool and Timmy will see you in the next video.